Welcome to Reading, Writing, and Critical Thinking Strategies, a podcast series built to support our Quinsigamon Community College students. Thanks for watching. Today's topic would be like a breath of fresh air. Yeah, did did you get that simile? That's right. Today's topic simile. Welcome and thank you for watching today's podcast. Please remember each podcast is meant to refresh, rejuvenate, and recharge your brain with all the essential information we learned in class. Simile. A simile is a figure of speech that makes a comparison between two different things using the words like or as. Like or as. Like or as. We can find similes all over the place, especially in the way we talk to one another. We often hear comments like, Johnny is as fast as lightning. Of course, we realize that a lightning strike is so fast, it's almost instantaneous. The speed of Johnny is compared to that of a lightning bolt. The use of as in the example helps to establish the similarity. Similes make writing more interesting. She tried to get rid of the kitten, which had scrambled up her back and stuck like a burr, just out of reach. Little Women by Louisa May Alcott. Similes can add drama to writing. I would have given anything for the power to soothe her frail soul, tormenting itself in its invincible ignorance like a small bird beating about the cruel wires of a cage. Lord Jim by Joseph Conrad. Similes use just a few words to express big, big, big meaning. Kate inched over her own thoughts like a measuring worm. East of Eden by John Steinbeck. Similes encourage the reader to use their imagination and see amazing images. In the eastern sky, there was a yellow patch like a rug laid for the feet of the coming sun. The Red Badge of Courage by Stephen Crane. That's it. Take two unlike objects and compare them using as or like. And you have got yourself a simile. Practice adding similes to your writing today. And remember, similes have been known to make writing strong as an oak tree and sometimes sweet as sugar and on occasion good as gold. To find out more about figures of speech, watch my podcast titled Metaphor. Reading, Writing, and Critical Thinking Strategies, a podcast series built to support our Quinsigamon Community College students. Thanks for watching.